So let me tell you about one of the most exciting mythology I know of, and probably the most ancient mythology humankind has. That's about the Pleiades, or the seven sisters on the sky. This is a small cluster of stars on the sky that looks like... like this. They're very close to each other, and right underneath is a constellation called Orion. What's very surprising is that in vast different cultures that separated tens of thousands of years ago, this constellation Orion and this little cluster, the Pleiades, share the same story. These are seven poor little girls being chased by Orion the Hunter, probably not with any noble cause. What's surprising is that the story is the same in Aboriginal Australian culture, European culture, African culture, and many others. The solution to this, based on other archaeological evidence, DNA, and so on and so forth, is that this mythology of humankind actually originated at least 100,000 years ago, when we were moving out of the continent Africa. And as we spread, some moved towards Australia, some moved towards Europe, but this ancient mythology was preserved in the culture of all of these nations. So the starry sky, and in particular the constellation Orion and the Pleiades, gives us an insight back into one of the most ancient, not written, mythological moments of humankind. Another interesting thing is that essentially all cultures call these seven sisters, but they also recognize that only six of these stars are seen. One, two, three, four, five, and six and they refer to one of the lost Pleiades, one of the lost girls. What could be the reason for one of these stars lost?